Hello everyone, and welcome back to the Adventure Game Jam 2016! So I lied to you last week when I said that this Game Jam ended uh, this week. But it doesn't. It actually ends in three weeks. It's got 22 days left, and I'm stupid. So with that being said, there's plenty of times, there's plenty more time to vote, there's plenty more time to play the games. So, we're gonna keep going with this, because I kinda like doing this format. Um, I haven't heard anything one way or the other, but I like doing it because I get to I get to touch a lot of the games and I get to showcase a lot of the games. So this game is Nothing Can Stop Us. So this is supposed to be a story game that's just kind of a text uh, choose your own adventure kind of thing, if I remember correctly. And I don't I don't I like these a lot, and it looks like everything is homegrown, the music as well. So and it looks really stylized, a little cartoony as well. And I don't think there's much to it besides the text-based adventure, but I'm curious about it because I kind of I kind of like building my own stories. So let's go. New game. Year 76. One. What? Hey, can you tell me something? Sure, dear. What is it? I have this feeling that I did something bad. I mean, something horribly bad. Is that true? It's too late now. Don't think about it. No, you didn't. Yes. No, you didn't. No, you didn't. Seven, year seven. You can see it from here. So this is that place you were talking about. Oh, it's back. I'm back in the past. Yes, how beautiful is this? Nobody comes here. I could kill you and get away with it easy. It's my secret place. What? Why would I say that? I mean, I guess it depends on how old they are at this point. It'd be kind of cool. Yes, how beautiful is this? I thought you were joking, but it's really nice. Screw you! Screw you! You can't tell anybody about it, about it, okay? You have to promise that. Cross your heart and hope to die. I promise. I'm serious. No one knows I come here. My mother will beat me if she hears it. Oh, wow, that's a little brutal. Hey, I promised already. Don't be a buzz killer. I will keep my mouth shut. Year nine. Oh, that's how old they are. What? Well, you have nothing. There's nothing to see. This is unfair. Oh, they're dropping and showing. <laughs> I'll show you mine if you show me yours. Oh, that's hilarious. Too bad for you. Your thing looks so weird instead. Isn't it uncomfortable? Uh, a little. But they say that when you grow up, it gives you some kind of power. Like a plasma gun. <laughs> it does give you something to shoot off. <laughs> anyway. Gross! I wouldn't want a plasma gun where I where I pee. I mean, if it was a real plasma gun, you couldn't complain. It's cool instead. You shoot women with it. Well, I wouldn't want to have to sit when I pee. Better a plasma gun than nothing. Ooh. It's cool instead. You shoot women with it. Uh, I mean, that's technically true. Would that be a response that I would do? Um... Yeah, better a plasma gun than nothing. My aunt says that you you men always have to over uh compensate with guns and stuff. That's why we're so cool. I like this guy. Uh uh sure. So what do we do now? I want to play Space Invaders. You always want to play that. But I don't have it at home. Come on, let's go. Don't have it at home. So I guess it's a game. Do you believe in God? Which God? Uh, you know, God. There are tons of different gods. You should be more specific. They're all the same in the end, just with different names. That is not true. Indians have many, many, for example. Uh, um, okay. Do you believe in some God then? Actually, I do. Yes, thanks for asking, but it's kind of personal. What about you? Um... In some shape or form, I do. I have to agree with that. Yeah, of course. Oh, of course. And what God do you like? Bible one, it's not it's not what I like, it's what is real uh it's not a personal preference, it's a family tradition. Um I wanna go with the second one because I really don't know how to describe even myself how I'd be able to describe it. So I'll go with that. It's not what I like, it's what is real uh Ahaha! Ah, you realize you were saying something silly. Uh, huh? Dot, dot, dot. 
So what about it? What's on your mind? You believe there's a plan to everything that happens? Are you going to ask me if what happened to my parents was part of some bigger plan? That's not... Fuck you! Screw you! Don't assume anything! Why did you bring that asshole here? It was a one-time thing. He got a new camera and wanted to... You're a liar! This is our place! Are you jealous? Is that what it is? This is awkward. Fuck you! Fuck you! I'm not jealous! You promised you would never bring anyone here! It was a one time- You promised! I don't like you when you're like this. I'm going away. Good, and don't come back, ever! Wow. I mean, I guess I can understand. Peace? Peace. You know, I miss you, you angry bastard. I miss you too. Aw. Nothing will stop us. Wait, you're telling me you're gay? I'm telling you I like girls. Ah, you are gay. Me, I'm a lesbo queen. Uh, wait, I'm answering for her? Have I been answering for her this whole time and not realizing it? Uh, you are gay. Me, I'm a lesbo queen. Eh, that sounds like a sarcastic response, I would say. Eh, yeah. Ah, okay, you seem persuasive enough, but I thought, I mean, you kissed me last summer. I didn't just kiss you, if I remember correctly. Are you saying my boobs are so lame that you forgot about them already? I did not! That's why... Look, I was curious and still uncertain. I wanted to see how it was with the, you know... A friend? A sexy beast? With a sexy beast? Ah ha ha! That's really not what I was gonna say. So you didn't like it? It's not that I didn't like it. It, it was nice. Just not, um, exciting as it should be. You know, it's possible that you simply don't like me. That didn't make you wet. Uh, I don't know. Maybe we try again? Uh, 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 no, I wouldn't go with that. Maybe we should try again. Uh, yeah, I'll go with that. Maybe we should try again. Ah, <laughs> in your dreams. Actually, now that I can imagine you doing some girl-on-girl -girl action, my dreams will get a lot better. Ah, <laughs> fuck you! Yeah, in my dreams. Ah, okay, okay, enough of that now. Sorry. Come here, stupid. Hug me. Mm. This is kind of cool, because it's just a regular story of average... Of, like, just growing up as average people. Oh, promise me that we'll be friends forever, and that we'll come here even when we get old. I promise you, nothing will stop us. Cross your heart and hope to die. Cross my heart and hope to die. You lied to me before, so why would I cross my heart? I'm saying it's ridiculously wrong. Well, you have always been the def def definition of anti-American, so I'm not surprised. Are you saying you agree with their evasion politics? This time you're right. Yes, the world is at war if you don't notice it. Ah, eh, nah. No, this time you're right. Oh, good. Then you want to come to next week's rally with me? You know I don't do rallies. I know your politic involvement borders on apathy. Come on. Leave me leave me be. And I don't give a fuck about Vietnam and rallies. Oh, it's from, it's back in Vietnam. I didn't know that. Okay. I have other issues right now. I'm sorry. You're right. How is your mother? I don't want to talk about that either. Oh, no. Look at those houses. They're gonna invade the whole valley. I heard they bought a lot of ter a terrain already. I hate them so much, whoever they are. By the way, did you get that job? Nah, didn't go well. Oh, why? I thought you were overqualified with your fancy university degree. Not sure. The guy looked kind of surprised when he saw me. I think he assumed I was white. Oh, am I a different... What? You mean before or after he saw you? Oh, fuck off. There's nothing to joke about that. You know me, I joke about everything, dear. Well, anyway, I have another appointment next week. Good, in the meantime, let's go play some Rocket League together. So, wait a minute, it's talking about Vietnam. Oh, when was Vietnam? Ah, I'm so stupid with history. Uh, let's go and spray a purple dick on his car. Let's go to a movie. Let's go to a movie. Taxi driver just came out at, at the Atlantis. Let's go there. Oh, I wanted to see Blade Runner. 
I lose a job. I get to decide. Ah, okay, you win. Year 76, too. So we're back in the future. Why are you playing your life all over again? I don't know. There's something there that I'm missing. You're at the early stages of Alzheimer's, aren't you? I still have to get a diagnosis. Your early memories feel brighter and you're attracted to them. Some, something like that. Yes, you make me feel like a moth now. If that's true, then who am I? You're my friend. Are you sure? What do you mean? I'm sick. I'm sick. Don't play with me. I'm not the one that is playing. So you're really doing this? Artificial insemination? I did it already. My uterus is having a blast right now. So you fucked a robot. I thought you would go for adoption. You could have asked me. Ah! Yeah, I mean, if she's dating another person, then that would be just, just wrong. Ah, let's go with that. You could have asked me. If you remember I tried once years ago, but you were so lame that you made me gay. <laughs> Hey, maybe you were so lame that you made me lame. Whoa, you mean you're still that lame because I'm still gay? Uh, I don't... Okay, that was well played. So is this going well? To be honest, it was not funny at all. They even gave me drugs to help the process, but not the good kind of drugs. I would have opted for adoption, but Adele strongly wanted a child with some of our genes. You really like Adele, do you? I love her! I really do! Imagine that, yesterday, humanity walked on the moon for the very first time. Pretty impressive, huh? Pretty impressive, huh? You know, standing here looking at the moon together makes me think of something. What? I really thought you'd grow up to be gay. I love you. I truly want to be a mother, you know? Oh, no. I mean, if I'm supposed to be picking the path for these people... Um, I really thought you'd grow up to be gay... I mean, this is her. This is her to him. I truly want to be a mother, you know. You're. You'll be a wonderful mother. I know, right? But your kids will hate you anyway. Aha! I know. I know that too. Fuck those ungrateful bastards. Yeah, they have no idea what you went through to push them out of your vagina. I'll make a video of it and show it to them so they can be scarred for life and respect me. I second that. Seriously, you will be awesome. Thank you. Now hug time. I really hate that they're colonizing the whole valley. Yeah, it sucks. You remember when there was not even a single house? We're getting old, are we? Hey, maybe you are getting old. Me? I'm still in my prime. No! We're immortals! No! We're immortals! Uh, that doesn't sound much fun either. So how's things with the baby? I gave up after the last- Oh man. His carriage. I don't want to do that anymore. Oh, I'm so sorry. I didn't know that. Yup. How did Adele take it? She wanted to insist, this time with her uterus, even if the odds would be even worse than with mine. You never know. There st might still be a chance. Fuck that. I never believed in miracles, and I don't e even believe in God anymore. Oh, don't say that. Why shouldn't I? I, I fuck girls. I don't want anything to do with someone or something that tells me my life is a sin. Fuck you, God. Hey, calm down. I packed my stuff and left her two months ago. I'm crashing at Fisa's now? Anyway, I was screaming, I was screwing Fisa during all of last year, so it's no big deal. I'm so sorry. I could only guess how hard it must have been. Don't cry. Come here. Let me cry. Just hug me. What? I thought we were going to get married. Fuck's sake. Huh. Whoa! I'm speechless. That really changes everything, does it? I mean, I always believed in aliens, but you never thought you'd get to see them. Yeah, I know the feeling. Also, fuck! It's amazing that they appeared over our valley. They say there's a dozen of those ships around the world. Yes, but still, one of them is over our fucking valley! I told you this place is cool. You were so right. So what about your god now? This is kind of a bit a deal breaker. I'm not into that, not necessarily. God and aliens can coexist. I don't know, maybe I'll just consider this a dream. Very cool dream. Nah, I'd go with that. Well, good for you. Nothing can stop us. Look at that horror down there. The town conquered the whole valley. Yes, well, I mean, it's still beautiful from up here, but also depressing. 
I didn't tell you, but I bought an apartment in that town. What? When? Some four years ago, Delina and I put our money together and did it. Which one? The tall building, one of the upper floors. Hmm. Mm-hmm. I guess nothing can stop us humans from spreading all over the world, huh? No, I guess not. I forgive you. Why? That is... Why? That is mighty kind of you, sir. Thanks. But you better not build a house on this hill here. Aha! I promise I won't. Your past memories don't seem that legit to me. They're just memories, not precise. Representations. Oh, I get it. But they're based on our life. Do you know what a memory really is? Our life? Do you, do you know what a memory really is? Uh, it's something you store in your mind. Why are you so inquisitive? Memory is not data. It's a dream, or at least more close to a dream than to reality. You are messing with my mind. Please don't do that. And you are putting in, you are putting in my mouth words that were never mine. But that is how I remember it. Yes, remember, but that's, that is not reality. Why did you bring that asshole here? It was the one time thing. Oh, we're back here again. You're a liar. This is our place. Are you jealous? This is awkward. Uh, we got this again. It was one time. You promised. I don't like when you're like this. I'm going away. Good. And don't ever come back. Ah! Uh, did he push her? Does that mean I killed you? Oh, no, dear. No, I just fell. But I scared you. You ran away without looking because I scared you. Then I guess it's complicated. You were always so very ill-tempered, my dear. Nothing could stop you when you were like that. Hmm. Oh, no! Oh, no! This is the end, beautiful friend. Oh, no! That was, that was really good! That was a good story. I mean, that's all it was, was just the story. But it was a... A regular story besides the aliens which was kind of weird but it was just a regular story of two friends that have known each other forever but nothing stopped them from being friends minus you know death but they were there for each other during the during the, the ups and downs and the heartbreak and everything but that was cool I'm not really sure if other th other things would give other paths or anything like that but um, uh, you guys should try it out for yourself that was that was good but that was the first game in the three games that I'm going to play for this week. I really like this one. I love the story in this one. I'd love to see what, what's going to happen with the other path. But anyway, let's get on to the next one, shall we? All right, everyone, and welcome to Esther and the Fallen Star. So if you remember, I played Boybot, uh, or Starbot. Yeah, Starbot, not long ago. This kind of this kind of looked like it would remind me of that with the little girl uh, hugging the star. And the... The uh, Starbot was also about a fallen, falling star, or fallen star, or a star plant, not a fallen star necessarily. But anyway, I, I liked the art look of this. It looked it looked very very bright, very colorful, very vibrant. So I thought I'd give it a try and see what it is about. Fallen star. I'm asleep. Mm -hmm. I don't know if there's any text or if it's stole if it's a story told through action, which I like stories like that. Oh, cool. So, is this a point and click, I think? Not W A S D. Yeah, it's point and click. Okay. Let's see, walk to bed. All right, walk to bed. Oh, cool. Do, 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 do. Walk to calendar. Walk to post. Is that an Undertale poster? It is. Stay, stay determined. It is an Undertale poster. And that's, uh, 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 oh, oh, um, um, Steven Universe. Yeah, I remembered that. Yeah, but Power Girl. It looks like Steven Universe, but like Sailor Moon. Huh. I think, maybe? Okay, let's see. Walk to Game Boy. Oh, look, there's a PlayStation. There's a Game Boy. There are balloons. Wow. Okay. I'm assuming this is possibly a little girl by the rosy cheeks, but it's a child. But there, there's unicorn stuff. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to assume that it's a girl just based off of this thing. Toy Story! Oh, man, Toy Story! All right, let's keep going. Do, 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 do. Let's see. Walk to mom and dad's bedroom. Oh, I can't walk in it. Oh, let's walk outside. Wasn't there, wasn't mom or dad just behind me? So, I guess I'm supposed to go outside. Do, 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 do. Um, okay, can't go outside. Probably in the backyard. Walk down the hallway. 
That doesn't lead to the garden. I should go there and investigate first. Okay. <laughs> These are some freaky modern arts. I can't go get the... Oh, go to the garden. Go into the garden. Go to the garden. Back door. Seesaw with ponies. This is probably going to be a girl. Do, 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 do. Oh, wow! Question, question, question. What? 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 What am I supposed to do? Oh! Um, talk to. This. Oh, cool! Hello? Ow, what happened? Oh, you can talk? Where am I? You're in my garden. Garden? What's that? It's a place where you can play plant some... You can play, plant some plants, and, well... Some, some, that kind of stuff. Hey, wait, wait, what are you? I'm a star, a pretty star. I'm a huge star. A star? Yeah, a star. Don't you know what a star is? Of course I do. I have studied them at school. I love to study about stars, space, and I'm... Ugh. I want to be an astronaut and have my own spaceship to travel around the universe from the Earth. Oh, so am I on Earth? Oh, no, I didn't get to read that. No! Funnier planets. That's impossible. We have plushies, cats, and maybe that greatest thing ever existing, chocolate. I've seen pl uh, planets made of chocolate out there, out of there, sweetie. Really? Oh, well, I guess Earth isn't that cool anymore. By the way, what's your name? Name? What is a name? Names are, uh, like, words. Names are words that are used to, you know, like, identifying something. Everybody and everything has a name. I guess we stars don't know anything about that sim semiotic stuff. Blech. Oh, don't worry. I will teach you. My name is Esler. You know, you may call me Esler when you need something from me. Esler, Esler, Esler. Nothing? I was testing it. I like how it sounds. Ah, thanks. So you, don't you have any names? No. Why would I have a name? I told you that's the way we identify you. If you don't have a name, I'll give you one. Would you like to be called Nuru? I rolled the R. I don't know why. I don't want to click. Nuru. 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 Nuru! Holy Quasar! I love it! It sounds amazing to me! Please- Ah, crap! From now on, I will call you Nuru. Yeah, I'm Nuru, and I'm the greatest star in the whole universe. I'm the only star with a name. You are a liar. There are lots of stars with names. In fact, you are not wrecked! Why are you saying that? Well, here on Earth, we are to give names to stars. If you look at the starry night, you may see Pollux and Terus, Sirius, Altar, and the Sun. Those are the stars with names. Plus, we name satellites, too. You see that white, big point in the sky? That's the moon. <laughs> Good lord, she's an intelligent girl. Am I not special? So I guess your favorite hobby is making me feel sad or something. Screw you. Oh, I'm sorry, Nuru. I didn't do it on purpose. Don't worry, I'm not sad because of you. So why are you sad, then? Because I don't have enough energy to go back to space. I'm a young star, as I told you. Although I'm, pr I'm a pretty star, I'm not able to do some things like travel thousands of kilometers. And I guess space is far from your garden. This is kind of weird because it's... Oh, I will give you an answer. But we need to find out, we need to find out before the day rises. Because my parents will wake up and they don't let me... They don't let me to have pets on our house. So I guess you won't be allowed to stay here. <laughs> Okay, once the once the dialogue stops, I see. Don't be don't be sad, Nuru. You you don't have to worry because I can help you reach space. How? We need a lot of energy. Don't worry, we can build a tool to boost your energy. Like what? A seesaw catapult. What is that? I will show you when it's finished. You will get to space thanks to the seesaw catapult. I will craft I will craft it. Stay here until I come back. I will craft a super duper seesaw catapult that will allow you to go back to space. Okay, I will wait here. Okay, so the text is like super long. Uh, it if it was kind of split up a little bit more, it would. It, I think it would be a little bit easier to read, and it kind of speeds through quickly with smaller smaller text. Oh wait, I went back to the living room. Go back. I want to investigate. So I have to build a seesaw. Oh, that I haven't been in there yet. I have to build a seesaw to catapult the um, star back into space, or that's the general idea. Doubtful that will work. Uh, oh, wait, 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 wait. So, can I use umbrella stand? No? <laughs> Pick up umbrella? Maybe I will need it later, but for now, it's better to leave it. Oh, okay. Um, pick up... Okay, there's nothing to pick up. Go pick up the hallway? I don't need it. I can pick up the hallway, because I'm that strong. How do I know what I need? 
Um, oh, I can look at stuff. I haven't been looking at anything. Look at the empty bottle. You didn't look at the empty bottle. Okay, pick up the empty bottle. Oh, I picked it up! Huzzah! I don't know what that's supposed to do. Bookshelf. Okay, use the bookshelf. Pick up the bookshelf. Okay, let's keep going. I don't, I don't know. I don't really know what I'm supposed to be looking for to, to finish this. So there may be a lot of gaps where nothing is happening. And if there is, I'll, I'll probably have to cut out a lot of that. So let's uh, walk to the lobby. We have a lobby? Wow, we're fancy. Let's see, those are scissors. I bet you I can take those. Scissors. Um, so walk to, I can't, there's nothing there, nothing there, nothing there. Um, okay, so I guess I'm just going to go around and loot things for now. Pick up a pot. Okay, I have a pot, wine glass, and scissors. Use... Oh, there's a funnel. Pick up the funnel. So do I need to use this? Wait, use the bottle, the funnel. Nope. So, so it's got, it's going to be one of those combining things. All right, so what if I use... This, the pot with that, no? Use the pot. Oh, wait, use pot faucet. Oh, I got a buck, I got a thing of water, cool. So I can't take the vinegar. Nope, can't take the vinegar. Oh, there's a cardboard, pick up cardboard. Cool. Um, anything in here? I am walking over everything. Okay, I I'm sorry. I'm I'm gonna be I'm gonna be roaming around for a little bit, but so the game is stylized and it's a point and click adventure, and it's it's that cartoony style. And if everything was drawn, if all of this was drawn by hand, and this this is incredible, it's it's just very simple, um, and it's enjoyable and it's it's very happy. It's very cheery. It's got a lot of colors that are that are a lot of cheery colors. Oh, I'm back in the hallway. So this is the lobby, um, and I I I like I like the colors. I like how everything looks, um. See, can I go into mom and dad's room? Nope, I cannot. So there's nothing there. Oh, they're sleeping. I just walked past and heard them. So there's my bedroom. What's over here? So I'm not. I all I know is that I'm supposed to be helping the star get back to space, kind of like when I was helping um, uh, the star understand uh, everything else. Dental floss. Can I take that? Pick up. Cool. Um, so right now I'm just looking for items. To maybe I'll need that later. Uh, to, I guess I'm just gathering items. Oh, I'm, I'm behind this. Don't need that. Okay, so I got some detergent. So, use this, that. Oh, cool, I did. And use this with this. These two items don't seem to work together, okay. Scissors with cardboard. And cardboard. Oh, cardboard fins. Oh, I'm building a spaceship. Oh. Oh, I bet you I'm using a spaceship and I'm going to use. Oh, and I'm going to use vinegar and um, baking soda, maybe, to turn it into a rocket or something. Holy crap. To use suitcase. Nothing. Pick up suitcase. Nope, can't use that right now. Right? Uh, pick up room. Nope, can't use that. Uh, baby car seat? Pick up baby car seat. Cool. So, can I use the fins on the car seat? Nope. Wait. Use car seat with fins. Nope, they don't seem to go together. Alright. Anything else in here? I can't pick up the broom. Look at broom. I want to break free. That's dad's favorite son. He sings it all the time. What? Uh, look at suitcase. We used it during last holiday summer. Talk to suitcase. Use the suitcase. Okay, there's nothing to use. All right, I think I've been in all of the rooms. I think I've gotten everything. So it's it's very simple. So it's this is the this is one of the game jam games. So it's not. So there are s some hiccups here when it comes to the graphics. Um, ooh, can I pick up the balloons? Aha! 
<laughs> Can I pick up the PlayStation? I'll let her take it back to her planet. Pick a backpack? Okay, pick up... Books? Nope, not school books. There's my bed. Oh, look, the Adams Family picture in the background. I didn't notice that. Is there anything else? Use notebook? Pick up notebook? Nope. All right. So I think I have everything. There's, there's mom and dad's room. I don't want to go in there. Go back downstairs. And we're going to go into the kitchen again. Because I think I forgot something. So the dining room connects to the kitchen. Just looking over everything. Look at... That picture looks strange. So surreal. She has a really good vocabulary for potentially a little girl. I'm assuming she is just based off of the room. And I'm assuming she's a girl based off of the room. Not to say that boys can't have unicorns and everything like that. But it's just my assumption. It's just my opinion. Do, 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 or my observation. Hey, look, it's that picture again. Oh, look, a garage. Cool. Some more stuff out here. Let's see. Um. Oh, look, it's Overwatch, but it's the You Can Do It Girl. And, oh, what is that poster? Is that Team Fortress? No, maybe? I don't know. Pick up. Let's see. Oh, 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 oh. Poster? Nope. Let's see. Pick up. Pencil case. I have a feeling that I won't need that. Okay. Screw you. You don't know me. Was there nothing? Is there nothing I need? There has to be something. There has to be a reason I came in here. There doesn't seem to be a reason that I, why I came in here. Use car. Pick up car. <laughs> uh, hallway. There's nothing there that I can use. What am I missing? Okay, I think I'm going to skip ahead here until I find something new, so I'll be right back. Okay, I think I found a bubble gun with the soapy water. So what do I do with the soapy water? Uh... Hmm. You and you? What is that? Oh, that's the floss. Hey, I, it, I, uh, I read a thing that said it was duct tape in here, but I can't find where the duct tape is. And I'm mousing over everything, and I don't see anything that would make me think there's duct tape. Case. Boys. She said, they said it was in the storage room. I'm just gonna mouse over everything. Oh, crap. Faucet? I already used a faucet, so I don't think I need to do that again. What was that? Pick up toothpaste? Nope, don't need that. Trash bin, use trash bin, nothing in there. Clothes. Uh, I don't think I can take any clothes. Nope. Okay, so this is, it's, it's not very straightforward, and I kind of know, I kind of get an idea that I'm building a, uh, like a little ship or something, but I'm missing stuff, and I'm having a hard time finding it, finding it all, so that's why it's taking me so long. Cool books, see nothing, nothing there, nothing there, so it's, this this may be a little bit longer because I, I, I kind of want to finish this. Um, because I want to see how, how, how this is going to actually work just because, um, of, like, these random little pieces that I'm picking up. So what may happen is I may just be sit, I sit here for a minute and attempt to combine everything until something happens. Oh, what was that? Oh, mirror. Alright, so, let's just start using some items and see what happens. Here's that vinegar again. So I put... Oh, I tried to do that the first time and that didn't work. Uh, 
All right, so I've got vinegar in a bottle. Oh, baking soda. Pick up baking soda. Yeah. So I probably combine use this with this. Use this with nope. Balloons with that. Nope. Soapy water with this. I'm pretty sure that that would already be going through its reaction. Funnel. This. Nope. Okay, so I'm still looking for stuff. I think I think the duct tape might be the last thing that I need. And I'll be able to finish building it because I think I have an idea of how this is supposed to potentially look. But I've got to find that duct tape, which said it was in the supply room, but I went around that whole supply room and could not find it. So, BRB again. What? You said there's glue inside that. What? Wait a minute, what? Oh, I see. Oh, okay. No. Hold up, I'm I'm figuring stuff out. Nope. I mean, something happened, so that's a good sign, at least. Little cross, funnel. Use a bottle with gas. Use pins. Car seat. No. Bag of balloons. No. Look at soap. Agent 008 reporting for duty. Nice. Really? So this is what I'm supposed to be doing? I'm supposed to be using all of these on, on her as experiments? Nope. What? No. No. The heck? The heck? Look at balloons. They float thanks to helium. Where did I get the helium from? Uh, okay. I mean, I want to finish this, but this is, I've been at this for way longer than I should have, and I just cannot figure out what's going on because I didn't know that I was supposed to just randomly start using stuff on Naru, uh, Naru to get something to happen. And it's just, I've been, I've been, Spending too much time on this one. I like this besides the direction and the fact that I'm I'm pretty sure I'm missing one piece, but I can't find it. And I've clicked everywhere. I've gone in every room a bunch of times and I've skimmed it and I just can't find it. So I'm gonna stop with this one. I'm sorry that I didn't finish this one, but if you want to finish it yourself, I'll leave a link in the description below for you to download it. So let's move on to the next one and hopefully I'll be able to finish that one um, unlike I did with this one. So here we go. Oh, there's a railroad track on Dead Man's Crossing, but there hasn't been a train for a long time now. After the accident, the company closed the line. Nobody survived the crash. But on a clear night when the wind is low, the towns the townsfolk say they can still hear the train sh ah, chattering its way down the tracks. Clattering, maybe? The ghost train crashes and starts over again. Over and over again. Oh, cool. Click on the rear door to disembark, only when when is train stopped. Click on the character objects to interact with them. Click anywhere to move. Start and stop the train. Restart journey, view. I actually, I think this is, this is a point and click adventure. I was the driver of this engine here. It was my job to get these folks to their destinations. Now I gotta get them to the other side. Hello. On this very trip, I had planned to propose to my sweetheart here. 
but like a fool, I have lost our luggage, and with it, the engagement ring. Now we are forever two souls, not one. See the world, he said. <laughs> Trip of a lifetime, he said. My dear, I'm awful, I'm awful sorry, but I left our cases on the platform, he said. My mama always said he didn't have nothing under his hat but hair. Aw, that's not very nice. What a misery. What melancholy. Oh, what a misadventure. It's terrible, right? The train crashed, killing everyone on board, and now we're all stuck here between the afterlife and... I ain't talking about that. All my life I wanted to see the Grand Canyon. I travel halfway across the country, get on the wrong train, and miss it completely. What a calamity. What a catastrophe. What a... a cataclysm dot 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 what a disaster what despair what a a dope you are for getting on the wrong train will you knock it off with the alt, uh, alter eh, all iterations Ugh. english Alli alliter yep i english if i could just see the grand canyon once i could die happy die again happy oh cool um bridge Desert Canyon. Was I supposed to change that? Oh, I restarted. Oh. Oh, how do I how do I, how do I lever? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Stop. Sir. Door. No. No, 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 wait, 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 wait. How do I get off the train? Oh, wait, I have to go to the back. So, I think I have to... God, oh, jeez, there's so many people. How are you boys doing back here? We are rehearsing our play, senor. You are familiar with this scene, see? Er, uh, it is okay, senor. We are not actors. We are famous... We are famous mariachi band. Los Manos... Uh, Los Hermanos... Eh, I can't say that. But since the train crashed, our trumpet is ruined, full of sand from, de from the desert. We will never play again. It is hopeless. Here, senor, take our trumpet away. It makes us unhappy. It is not as if we can clean it. Clean it. Where could we find water in this desert? So... Oh, I can leave the train. Oh, I'm back at the station. I was right. I bet this luggage belongs to the lady and the gentleman traveling together. Fancy looking case for a fancy for a fancy couple. Okay, there was nothing else here. Or the train. Okay, so they need water. What do you need? Your head, probably? Don't know what you're bothering him for. He don't say much. What happened is we'd just gotten past the lake and he jumps up hollering, seen some gal skinny dipping or something. Of course he stuck his head right out the window. You know what comes next. He ain't been the same man since. He quit smoking too. Ha ha ha. Reckon he's waiting on being reunited with something, and it ain't just his troopy. His toopy. Ugh, his toupee. Never thought I'd die in no accident. Ten paces at dawn for me, or the gallows at least. Now I'm six feet under, just like my gold. My gold is. You talking about buried? Wait, you talking about buried treasure? Sure would love to see that gold one last time. You'll need a pickaxe to get it. I tossed mine. Let me see now. I jumped aboard at the bridge. Reckon I tossed it about five clicks down the track. Okay. So, can I give you this? I believe these cases here, here to be your property. My good man, I cannot thank you enough. How hopeful. Now I can get back to reading my dime store novel. In the last part, the hero proposed to his sweetheart under a full moon. It's so romantic, it's exactly how I'd want to be asked for my hand. Dot, dot, dot. My good man, I owe you my debt of gratitude for retrieving the ring. But unless I propose that... Ah! Okay, leave me be. Rest in the Grand Canyon. Okay, that's everybody. So I've got... The crossing. How do I change that? So i got to go to the Grand Canyon. The bridge. And then, ooh, a lake with water. Okay. Well, let's con- No, I started over again! Shoot, did that wipe out all my stuff? No, it didn't. Okay, so I have everything. Okay, cool. So... But, how do I- No! I did it again! Son of a whore! Okay, 
So you have your stuff. A good man, owe you debt, full moon, blah, blah, blah. Let's see. Skinny dipping, so I assume that's going to be at the lake. That's fair enough. I need to get to that canyon. That cannon. Canyon. Hmm. And the bridge is the next one after that. So how... There's nothing back here. Ah, no! Sorry about that. I clicked out of the game. Doo, doo, doo. Is there not a way to speed this up? Okay, he said five clicks past the bridge. I don't know if that's going to be... Ah, I did it again! Okay, and there's no door up here. Okay, so that's easy. So it's... Well, I say it's easy. Um, reading a book. Da 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 da. Pros, pros, and pros. How do I... How do I switch tracks? I don't right click or anything. There's no extra buttons. Ah! Oh, cool! There are extra buttons in this game. Oops, I stopped the train. Keep going, train. Okay, so you said saw somebody skinny dipping. Alright, how do I change? How do I change? How do I change? How do I how do I change routes? <laughs> okay, so he said bridge. He got on at the bridge. But how do I change routes? What the heck? Okay, so we're at the bridge. Alright, so let's stop the train. Close the map. And walk outside. Do 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 walking out the train. Oh wow, the tr the full train's not even in the on the bridge yet. That's awesome. Okay, so I'm on the bridge. Okay, there's nothing here. Crap. Okay, can I? So, where did he toss his pickaxe? He said he got on on the bridge. See, anything's different? Probably not. Nope. Okay. Ah, darn it! I keep clicking out of the game. So this is. I'm sorry. I'm not even commentating on anything. I'm just kind of playing the game. So I, I, I really like this idea. Um, it's another one of those um, click point and click games where you have to get everything and solve the stories and stuff, just like the one I just played or that I played before. The only difference is with this one there is. A slightly more direct goal in mind rather than it being um, not necessarily random uh, but you have to find out everything yourself in this it's at least giving you clues a high pickaxe I found it yay so I probably have to get everybody done before I get to the end. Looks like I found your partner in crime. Oh, now, where's the shiny stuff hidden? Well, y you see, the train crash gave me a nasty whack. All I remember is looking at that map and thinking X marks the spot. X marks the spot. Looking at my map? Uh... I see nothing unless it's at the crossing. I mean, that's definitely a possibility. Still don't know how to switch that. Alright, we're going to get to the lake. Desert station. Oh, does it loop all the way back through? There's a water tower as well. Let's get to the lake. I'll probably find this dude's head here. I assume this is where I'm going to find the guy's head because he, saw, because he said skinny dipping. And I mean, where else are you going to see that besides at a lake? Am I at the lake? I'm at the lake. Stop. Walk out of the train. Walk out of the train. Ha. Um. Oh, I can use this water here to clean the mariachi band's trumpet. Yay! The water looks awfully clear and clean. Oh. Oh, okay. I accidentally clicked on the lake, and he went over and cleaned it anyway. Here, guys. Here's your trumpet. It's good and clean. This means Los, Her Los Hermanos Esq 
Aquiletos are back in business. Thank you, amigo. How can we ever repay you? How about you give me that thing? If we that thing, uh, blow and play in tune. Dot, dot, dot. Not without money, amigo. We are not performing monkeys, amigo. Bring us money, amigo. So, I gotta go find that dude's gold. Okay. Map. So, let's keep going. Wait, wait. What did it say he got? This guy lost his head? Um, apparently this poor soul saw a naked young lady and lost his head. According to that law, that happened just after the train passed the lake. Roger! Roger Dodger! This is, this is really neat. So the story is being told... I mean, the, the whole point of the story is you're, you're... I guess you were trying to... Either make a man... Oh, he lost his... He lost it in the tunnel. Uh, you're either making amends for crashing the train, which, I mean, I don't think that would necessarily be... Uh... The conductor's fault completely I guess I mean not without knowing the the complete story as to how it all happened look like this was his head yep there's his head got it his toupee is actually missing and I hope he doesn't mind oh man this guy's gonna get a head in life <laughs> yeah sorry head joke whoa what happened why did I just teleport backward your friend, I have your head. I I can speak again. I can see again. I, you look taller too. The last thing I remember, a vision of loveliness, a beautiful woman bathing. I hope she was worth it. Why she was? What a way to go. I can't thank you enough. I, may his, uh, salacious, oh, soul rest in peace. Cool. I got one. Woohoo. Okay. So he just said X marks the spot. That guy said a full moon, but how, how do I do a full moon? Let's see, he just said X marks the spot. You, my good man, da da da, full moon. You were looking for the Grand Canyon. Ah, I clicked out of the game again. All right, let's keep going. So how do I get the full moon? How do I move? How do I get? All right. So nothing's happening here. But I don't. I don't know how to how to adjust the track back at the beginning. How do I make you go up? Oh! I stopped the train at that location to do it. God, jeez. Oh, it's night. Kick ass. Stop. My good man, I owe you for debt, engagement, but unless it's a full moon. This is a full moon! Oh. If you'll meet me outside the train, you can take a view of, take a good view. Oh. Okay. Let's go outside the train. Do 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 That's a nice that's a nice moon. My dear, on such a night, it would make my it would make me the happiest man alive. Dead. Happiest man who is dead. Dot, dot, dot. It would make me the happiest man who is dead if you could do me the honor of being my wife. I, w I will, my love. Just don't lose my luggage again. Yay! True love indeed. Sweet. Alright. So, the mariachi band guys want... So I think I'm going to have to start over, because I don't think there's anything left there. So let's reset. And I need to make sure at 9, I go out and flip the switch, like a smart person would have figured out the first time through. Also, I need to start stop at the crossing. I think that's where the treasure is. It's the only X that I can see. Going to the crossing and stop. I really like this. I like this. I like this form of uh, of storytelling. I mean, the, the the point and click. There's there's not a whole lot of um, like you know action adventure anything to it. But they usually show a pile of dirt. Let's see, looks like the man said X marks the spot. Now let's have a pick at, pick at the pile. I'm rich, or I mean, there's no need 
No such thing as a victimless crime. I should give this back to that kindlier outlaw fella. Um, but a lot of a lot of them have really good stories, or uh, or, or like tell really good stories as you figure things out. Um, except for sometimes I'm just stupid. Say this hoard of gold belonged to you, my treasure. Well, it ain't technically mine, but it sure does me good to see it one last time. You keep hold of that. It's no use to me now. So long, partner. Sure makes me happy to see a violent, thieving criminal smile. Yep, me too. So then this, these guys want the gold. Okay, take this treasure. Now, you... Mira, mirage? Oh, meager mariachis better blow that horn. I hope your music has more, more to it than you do. Thank you, amigo, and no need to be rude. Do do des... Do do disputes distress. Vamonos! Uno, dos, tres! I don't know where the other instruments are coming from. Now, we just have the Grand Canyon guy. Sweet! Alright, so let's wait until we get to the Grand Canyon. Too bad I can't speed up the train. Now we wait. Okay! Stop the train! Get off of the train. Aha! Turn it. So my map is different now, right? It is. Sweet. All right, let's go see this douchebag in his Grand Canyon. Is this the Grand Canyon? Oh, I'm in the Grand Canyon. Stop. Hey, friend. Leave me be. Why has the train stopped? We took a detour. If you'll meet me outside, there's something you'll see. I mean, for I mean, for for a, a conductor who's dead, uh, he's a really he seems like a really nice semi rude guy. Click 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 click. Mister, may I introduce you to the beautiful, breathtaking, blow me down if it ain't the Grand Canyon? Why, I'm so happy to be here, I could just die. Speaking of which, I did it. I managed to get them all safely to the other side. I'm fading away, going to that great train yard in the sky. Start the train. Start the train. <laughs> Hooray! I did it! So, that's the last game in another set of Game Jam games. Seems like I got a lot a I got a lot of inadvertently point and click or storytelling adventures. And I am gonna be perfectly honest, that wasn't the goal. I actually just picked three of them that uh, that interested interested me but um, that's the last one so I'm gonna stop here so thank you for joining me on these three adventures um, if you like this make sure to like if you'd like to join the party yourself make sure to hit that subscribe button if you have any suggestions on adventures you'd like to go on leave a comment down below and who knows maybe we'll go on your adventure next time see ya